Today we have an intriguing challenge. We have two tables, one with product price lists on various dates and another with transaction records. Our goal is to add the correct price to each transaction based on the product name and date. The challenge lies in finding the relevant price for each item at the given date, not just merging the tables. To solve this, I want to introduce you to a powerful method called cross-join. Let's begin by opening the Power Query editor for our transactions table. Copy the path to our source table as we'll need it shortly. Add a new custom column and name it price. Insert the copied table path into the formula, changing the table name to price list. This step completes the cross join, resulting in each transaction having a nested price list table. The next step is to filter the nested table to find the relevant price. We'll do this step by step. Modify the custom column formula using the let in expression. This allows to declare variables and use them later. Let's define variables for the current product name and transaction date. This will help filter the nested price list tables later. Now create a formula to select only the rows with the same product name as the current transaction using table select rows function. Check the result. Each nested table should now contain prices for only the relevant product. Now we can add a second condition to filter rows where the price date is less than or equal to the transaction date. Check the result again. Some nested tables may contain multiple rows. Use the table last function to select the most recent price for each nested table. You can do this either in the current step or by creating a new one. Specify the price column using square brackets to extract it. Your transaction table should now have the relevant prices. This technique may seem a bit complex initially, but it's highly effective once you master it. Give it a try and see the results for yourself. See you next time!